Hi, this is Peggy Taphorn, Producing Artistic Director of the Temple Theater. We are Central Carolina's Performing Arts Center, located in Sanford, North Carolina, about 25 minutes south of Raleigh. As an award-winning actress, director, and choreographer, I am thrilled to bring my experience to the Temple Theater tradition. I've been lucky to have appeared on Broadway, off-Broadway, in London, and toured the United States, Canada, South America, and the Far East. At a certain point in my career, I transitioned from just being a performer into being a dance captain, a director, a choreographer, and eventually management. I've also taught master classes in dance, dramatics, and acting all across the country, and actually in South America as well. I left the national tour of Sweet Charity starring Molly Ringwald to helm the Temple Theater here in Sanford. The main reason that I was lured to Sanford, North Carolina was this beautiful vaudeville theater. It has a huge and unique and rich tradition of theater dating back to the 1920s when it was built. The Temple Theater was built as a vaudeville house, which is one of the earliest forms of theater and entertainment. It was built by the Ingram family because of its proximity to the railroad station. You see, back in the good old days, shows would travel from New York City all the way down to Florida, and Sanford, North Carolina was one of those stops along the way. After the demise of vaudeville, the Temple Theater became a burlesque house. After that, it turned into a movie theater during both of the World Wars. And there's an interesting story. The soldiers from Fort Bragg used to take the train to Sanford. And the theater was open 24 hours a day, and soldiers would just watch movies as long as they were on leave, jump back on the train, and head back to Fort Bragg. Unfortunately, like most theaters, it fell into a period of decay and uh, was ultimately left sort of to founder until the citizens got together in the 1980s and refurbished it into the beautiful gem that it is today. Today, all of our productions are professionally done. We hire union and non-union actors, stagehands, creative teams, directors, choreographers, lighting designers, set designers, uh, which leads us to be the economic engine of historic downtown Sanford. All of that happens in this beautiful national historic landmark, the Temple Theater. As Central Carolina's Performing Arts Center, the Temple Theater dynamically blends the rich history of theater tradition with a new modern artistic quality. We provide not only professional high quality theater, but also myriad youth programs and special events. We bring in local, national, and international talent to the Temple Theater stage. Part of our mission here at the Temple Theater and one of my personal passions are our youth programs. Since I arrived here in 2007, we have expanded our youth programs five-fold. We now include two summer conservatories, which serve over 90 area youth. We do a winter youth conservatory, which focuses on either Shakespeare or a play that has advanced language skills. We also do a wonderful program called the Temple Teens. They are the best ambassadors the Temple Theater has ever had. They perform a high-energy song and dance show about the current Temple Theater season. They also do special events. We do a special Christmas show and a Valentine's show. Again, we are offering these kids the opportunity to go out in our community as ambassadors. They have to stand up in front of large groups of people, and the people are always amazed at how professional and how talented these kids are. I think the kids come away from these conservatories not only with an appreciation for the arts, but with skills that will serve them in the 21st century workforce. We teach them skills like public speaking, how to be self-motivated, how to think creatively and outside the box. All of these skills that they can use later in their life, whether they have a career in the theater arts or not. By participating in the arts, you're invited to bring your experience and collaborate with the artists on stage. The audience is a very important part of what the arts have to offer. And I believe they are a bridge in our community. We can cross cultural lines, age lines, gender lines, and bring all of this experience up for discussion. To be an active participant in live theater is to be given a gift. And live theater is one of the only art forms that only happens in the moment. There are no retakes, there are no rewinds. What you see in that one performance only happens uniquely that day. Your experience, like the actors and the performers and the singers and the dancers, is unique to that experience. Each time an audience comes into the Temple Theater, we ask them to actively participate in what we are presenting. 
you are asked to forget about the worries of your day and spend a couple of hours suspending your disbelief and being engaged and involved and active in what you're seeing on the stage. I believe that the arts give back so much more than the dollars and cents that they are given. The sense of community that they evoke, the skills that they teach our children are something that you just can't get elsewhere. And I believe that support for the arts is not only important today, but in the future.